In a quaint village surrounded by lush forests, two boys named John and Vicky were the best of friends. Every day they walked to school together, passing by the beautiful trees that lined the forest road. The trees whispered secrets, and the birds sang sweet melodies making their journey magical. One day, after a particularly long day at school, John and Vicky found themselves walking home later than usual. The sun was setting, casting long shadows across the path. The once friendly forest now seemed eerie and full of unknown dangers. John, it's getting dark. We should hurry. You're right, Vicky. Let's walk faster. As they quickened their pace, they suddenly stopped in their tracks. In the distance, they saw a bear slowly crossing the road, its massive figure looming in the twilight. John, what do we do? There's a bear. I can climb a tree. John swiftly climbed up a big tree and hid among the thick branches. Poor Vicky, who didn't know how to climb, was left standing alone on the road, his heart pounding with fear. Vicky, try to hide! Do something! I don't know what to do. The bear is getting closer. Just as the bear was about to reach him, Vicky remembered that bears do not eat dead creatures. He took a deep breath, lay down on the ground, and pretended to be dead. The bear approached, sniffing around Vicky. It circled him, its hot breath making him tremble even more. After a few tense moments, the bear seemed to lose interest and wandered away into the forest. Once the bear was gone, John climbed down from the tree and rushed to Vicky. Vicky, are you okay? What happened? What did the bear do? John, the bear came close and sniffed me, but then it whispered something in my ear. Well, what did it say? It told me, don't trust friends who abandon you in times of trouble. I'm sorry, Vicky. I should have helped you. I'll never leave you alone again. I know, John. We'll always look out for each other. And so, John and Vicky continued their walks through the forest, their bond unbreakable.